Cosworth Church of England Primary School. My name's Mrs Moore and I'm your Executive Head Teacher. We are so excited that you are going to be joining our school family this September. And usually at this time of year, we would be having a meeting to give you all of the information that you need. This year, we have to do things slightly differently. So we're going to take you on an exciting tour and you're going to be meeting some very important people. We're also going to be sending out an information booklet in the post, but if you have any questions or worries or concerns, please do not hesitate to contact us by email and you can find our email address on our website. We, as I said, are very excited, so it's time to come this way. Come with me. I'm Miss Rogers and you'll find me in the office. This is our fantastic school entrance hallway. Um, you can find Miss Rogers in the office to help you and you can also find Mrs. Sota Cole. Good morning, I'm also here to help you too. Follow me and I'll take you to your classroom. Hi, I'm so glad you have come to join us here at Curie Class at Costaworth School. My name is Mrs Abby and I'm the teacher in this classroom and I can't wait to see you and do some amazing learning with you. Hi, I'm Mrs Wilson and I help you in your classroom too. Uh, let's go look around the classroom. There's all wonderful things we can do. Come on in. This is our cloakroom. When you come in in the mornings, you will have a coat peg that you can hang your coats on and your PE bags. Your PE bags will have your t-shirt and your shorts and your trainers in. Um, your coats, only when it's a cold weather, but you need those. And then sometimes we bring our wellies in and we use those when we go outside uh, on a welly Wednesday when we go and do lots of exploring outside. That's really exciting. If you need the toilet when you come in in the morning, they're just here. I'll open the door so you can have a quick look. We have some time on the carpet when we're in Kiri class. We have our register when we call your names out. And we also have some of our learning time. Sometimes we do some learning on the board or sometimes we use our smart board as well to help us with our lovely learning. While we're sitting down, we have to sit in a certain way. Shall I show you? We have to cross our legs and be super sitters. Jimmy's telling us. We also have to have our magnet eyes. That's when we look at the person who's talking to us. We're lovely listeners in Kiri class. And if we want to say something, we put our hands up. When you're in Kiri class, we do lots of lovely activities to help us learn to do our reading and our writing. We learn lots of new letters. That's called our phonics time. Sometimes we learn them just as one little letter. Sometimes we learn to read them when they're put together. Sometimes we learn to read them when they're in our books. We all have a little book to take home with us. Our books fit inside our reading bags and your reading bag will fit nicely into your tray. We have Fred in our classroom. Fred not only helps us with our reading, but he helps us with our writing as well. He helps us listen for those sounds and we learn to write our letters. It's really, really exciting. We don't just do activities with the grown-ups in the classroom. Sometimes you get to have a chance at doing some lovely writing and some lovely reading by yourselves. You can go to the writing area or you can go to the reading corner. It's up to you. We love stories in Curie class. 
we can come and sit in our book corner and read stories to our friends or ourselves or the teddy bears. Do you have a favourite story? My favourite story is Alma and Mrs Wilson's favourite story is Little Rabbit Fufu. We love learning about numbers in Curie class. So when you come, we're going to do lots of counting, lots of measuring, building things with shapes. Do you like counting? I bet you are a really super counter. We not only count things that we can see and we can touch, sometimes we count jumps or pops or little taps on our knees. Sometimes we have to count the spots on dice or the spots on dominoes. And sometimes we have some friends that help us do our counting. Have you heard of the number blocks? Sometimes you might want to do some of your lovely math learning by yourself or with your friends. We have lots of things in our classroom that can help you. Just look. Like to make stories up and play with our friends in having lovely role play times. So in our classroom we have a role play area. At the moment it's a space centre but it could be anything that we want it to be. We love pretending to be things. So while you're in the role play area you might just have to put on a costume and pretend to be somebody else. Sometimes you might just want to work with the small world play and make little stories up for those as well. We have a construction corner in Curie class, so if you like building, we've got lots of things that can help you. Stickle bricks, Lego, Duplo, wooden blocks, we've got lots of things that you can come and play with. We like to make sure that our hands are super strong, that will help us be super super writers. So sometimes we do some finger gym exercises. It might be picking things up or it might be twisting things. We might be balancing things. Whatever it is, it will help our muscles grow nice and strong in our fingers and in our arms. We also have finger gym and do disco. We have do disco every day where we use the Play-Doh to make different shapes to make our muscles nice and strong. If you love technology, we've got our computers in the classroom all the time and we use iPads as well for lots of our lovely learning. Sometimes we do investigations, sometimes we use our light panel to help us. If you like being creative, you're going to love it in Curie class. We have painting, we have box modelling, we have clay, all sorts of exciting things that we can make and build and experiment with. Sometimes it's on this table where we can be a little bit messier. Sometimes it's on the other part of our messy area too. Sometimes your learning is just so amazing, we want to share it with your grown-ups at home. So Mrs Wilson and I will take a photograph or a video on the iPad and we will send it home on tapestry. Then everybody at your house will get to see how amazing you are. In Curie class, we have a piece of fruit that school provides us and a carton of milk every day. We can have it whenever we want it because we just keep it on the table ready for us. We also have a water bottle with our names on. So there'll be one with your name on waiting for you. That means you don't need to bring another drink from home because we'll have that filled with water every day. Just next to our cloakroom, we have our feelings pegs. That means that when you come in in the mornings, you can tell us how you're feeling. If you are super happy, you can pop it on the happy peg part. If you're feeling a little bit worried, you could put your peg there and then Mrs Wilson and I will know that you need a little bit of support and a little chat. 
In Curie class, we're all smarty pants. That means we're really talented at different things. Those are our God-given talents. So maybe we are really good with other people and we're really friendly, or maybe we're good at making things. Whatever it is, we celebrate your talents in Curie class. Let's go outside and see our marvellous outdoor learning environment. When we're outside, we have lots of fun, but we're always safe. So even when we're playing, sometimes we need to put our helmets on, even when we're using the stilts. We've got our water trays outside. We've got some more small worlds. We've got spaces to hang our wellies up. We've got spaces where we can sit and read. We've got spaces where we can walk and count. Zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We've even got spaces where we can do more investigating and some writing. When we're outside, we can do really big building too. So we have bricks and we have crates. And we have other things that help us make really big structures that we can work alongside our friends with. Use the sand tray outside. Outside we've got a stage. That means you can make performances and you can have an audience as well. We love being outside. We can be a little bit louder which means we can also play our musical instruments. From our cloakroom, if we come through this door, we get to see another really exciting room in our school. This is our library. I wonder if you can see any of your favourite book characters or any of your favourite books here. Hello, I'm Mrs Jordan and I'm the Head of School. Um, you are so lucky to be coming to our fantastic school and we are so lucky to be having you here, um, so thank you. Um, you will see me at lots of different times of the day, so you'll hopefully see me first thing in the morning um, and I can give you a big morning hello. Um, you'll see me around school at lunchtime and I love to hear about all of your fantastic learning that you've been doing in your classroom. Um, so we are going to have a fantastic year all together um, and start an amazing adventure. I'm also our school Senko and this room is a really special place as well. This is our sensory room. You can come here if you just need a little bit of quiet time. Mrs Cornish is our school mental health and wellbeing first aider and she sometimes brings children in here to work with and have a little chat with um, and then lots of things that we can use as well and um, we also have children that work with other people from outside of school and this is a really lovely space for them do you want to have a look around <laughs>
some fantastic school hall where we have collective worship and assemblies, we do productions and performances and we have PE. We also have fantastic school dinners and you will either be able to bring your sandwiches or have a hot lunch and sometimes you can even have both. We hope that you've enjoyed the tour and we hope that we've reassured you. Whether this is your first child starting their adventures at primary school or your last child starting their adventures at primary school, what we can assure you of is that their journey and start will be happy and they will be loved and cared for in our school family.